okay so here is something i'm playing with right now and it is this display it's a d-win display and just like the next gen or stone displays this is quote unquote intelligent or smart displays and what this means is this display already includes a microcontroller which is hidden behind this compartment and the microcontroller is responsible for drawing images in some cases drawing also video or playing some sounds so you can really just uh, offload all the heavy CPU tasks for this board, for this display, and then use any kind of microcontroller like the Arduino or Microbit ESP32, pretty much any kind of microcontroller to just send simple comments like comments like, you know, show me this image or, or show me this screen or play me this animation. And yeah, you don't need too much power. So again, even the simplest possible Arduino version should be efficient and enough, more powerful enough to drive the display and send those comments. So this is a 480 by 480 display. It's supposed to be an IPS screen. I guess I've seen better IPS screens, but it's not bad either. You can see on the direct sunlight, it's probably you no, know, not readable, but uh, other, it's not bad either. I mean, it's it's definitely much better than the next gen displays. And what I like about the display the most is this is the, probably the easiest way how to get hand, your hands on the square display, because usually. All the other displays has, you know, those kinds of like standard aspect ratios like you would have for your TV or for your monitor screen. This is a rectangular display, which is kind of special, kind of different looking display. And I really look forward to creating some kind of application for this one. Unfortunately, I don't have it hooked up with Arduino yet because I don't have the right connection board. I've ordered one, but unfortunately this was the wrong one. So I need a board where I can just connect this flat ribbon cable on one side and then have access to pins, which I can connect to Arduino. Unfortunately, this is the right number of pins, but the spacing is wrong. It's 0.5 millimeter. I need the, the one millimeter spacing, which is this side, but unfortunately this came unpopulated so i need to order it one more once more and hopefully this will be the right board so i can connect it to this display on this side and to arduino on this side and then start sending comments so right now this is just the automatic animation playing on this display but i can also jump to a second screen where i can use it my touch and just dragging the finger around you can see that i can also control the value for the display so this is what i'll what i will be doing in the future with arduino basically pretty much sending the send comments as i'm sending right now to set the value and maybe add some more stuff in there. So I hope you like this short overview. If you have any project in mind which you would like to use or you know me to create a project for this display, please let me down in the comment section and I hope to see you soon. Thank you for watching and bye.